Hello and welcome to another video from Cross Country Wireless. My name is Chris Moulding and today we're taking a look at the Broadband Active Antenna version 2. This is um, a wideband antenna designed for use with uh, SDR receivers. Uh, it typically covers from 200 kHz to 1100 megahertz. It will go higher than that but we can't guarantee the uh, radiation pattern. It tends to get a little you know, away from the horizon. So how does it work? Well above the label is a, um, a linearly loaded fan dipole. This works as um, uh, you know, multi multiband antenna on VHF, UHF. Uh, on LF and HF it acts as a short dipole, a, a short electrical electric field antenna. Uh, to make that work, the section below the label is um, stacked with ferrite as uh, common uh, common mode chokes and gives typically 40 dB of isolation between the feeder and the, um, the actual antenna element and amplifier itself. The um, amplifier, quite high performance amplifier inside here, uh, which uh, you know, it's perfectly matched to the antenna element. Uh, typically, power feed the power up the coax uh, from a bias T. From it will take from four and a half volts to fifteen volts. Uh, typical current about forty milliamps uh, through the antenna. It's ideal for use with, uh, an, say, an SDR play antenna, the bias T on uh, antenna B. Uh, works very well with that and covers all the uh, frequencies you need from uh, uh, the high UHF to uh, you know sort of long wave so it works very well for airband use so you can use it for airband um, HF airband and uh, ADSB uh, broadcast use ideal long wave medium wave short wave and VHF FM and DAB in the UK and Europe so how does it mount? Well we normally supply it with, right there's two um, hose clips, stainless steel hose clips mounted on the antenna with small loops and then two additional hose clips which tighten up onto a mast. If you're mounting it on a mast you don't want the mast to go above the label because then it may interact with the uh, antenna or, you know, lose some of the effect of the common mode choke as well. We also supply it with two um, reusable tie wraps, which are ideal for you know temporary use. In fact, we've got a temporary mast at the side of us to give a demonstration, and that um, you know the reusable tie wrap is very handy for uh, you know sort of temporary portable work. Okay, let's have a demonstration now of uh, on a demonstration using an SDR Play RSPDX receiver uh, and an antenna, one of these, mounted at about uh, five metres above ground. I think there needs to be, you know, there needs to be education in young people. This is uh, Medium Wave, uh, BBC and, and Radio Scotland. For those who directly have, they have have life-altering medical issues. Yeah, and, and just get ahead of it. Well, yeah. one desperately to be a leading power in media... BBC Radio 4 from Berghead. This is the new QA. Up with Abbey. 198 kilohertz. Golf investment in all parts of the UK is absolutely enormous. From the... 20 metre amateur band. Uh, Midday summer, so very poor propagation conditions. DSB. Uh, our location is uh, Elgin in northern Scotland. Uh, the tip of the arrow is where we are. So it gives you some idea of the... we, we don't have a lot of uh, uh, commercial uh, traffic up here so uh, this is what we, uh, what we typically, typically see. 